just as carrying carrying uh, flakards and water bottles. Uh, water bottles. My, my <laughs> Rex was killed on his way out of work. Let me let me let me. How do you feel? You. I mean, let me, let me tell you. When they hear let me, you let say me. criminals, I mean, are you are you telling me Rex is the one who broke uh, who burned Parliament? But Rex died without breaking. No, anything. no I'm just telling you. He died. You know, Rex, there oh, are died there are nothing. criminals yeah. who infiltrated and caused mayhem, and in fact, some of the criminals are actually harmed. They actually harmed the peaceful protesters. Many of the peaceful protesters, they lost phones. They were attacked. In fact, some of the uh, peaceful protesters were attacked by criminals, including a clear example of the one I have, I have, I have explained to you, that they overpowered the police, took the gun from the police, and started shooting innocent people. So we must deal with this situation globally. M Mr. President. I feel for Rex and the mother. This should not happen to any child in Kenya, especially when they are engaged in a peaceful demonstration. Mr. President, the, the concern I've heard from the young people, because I've been speaking to a lot of them, and they said they haven't heard you. In the two statements, actually, there are more now because you have spoken in other settings, apart from the two addresses you gave. They haven't heard you address them. They haven't heard you talk to these parents. They haven't heard you acknowledge that there were people who were shot by police in circumstances.